Hi, I'm Ryan Thompson. I play the fiddle and a few other different instruments, and I'm going to tell you a true story. Yesterday afternoon, I was doing some things around the house, and the phone rang. So I answered it, and it was my friend Steve, and Steve said, Hey, Ryan, we're having a picking party up at my place later this afternoon. He said, I'd love it if you could come. He said, why don't you get your son, you guys get your fiddles together, and come on up. So I said, well, that sounds really good. So I hung up, and I found my son, and we got our fiddles, got in the truck, and we drove up to Steve's house. And he's got a, a nice house that overlooks some fields up on a ridge up on the mountain. And he's got a place in his living room there where it had chairs all sitting in a circle. And people were playing songs all around a circle. They were taking a turns, and they were playing, singing country songs and folk songs and different things. And it came around to my son and I, and he said, well, what would you guys like to do? And I looked at my son, I said, why don't we play the Arkansas Traveler? It's a good old American tune. It starts like this. Now, we started out playing, and I noticed a couple people were having a little bit of trouble figuring out the chords on it and how to accompany the tune. So I said, you know, it's in the key of D. It's got D and A chords in the first part, and then the second part's got D to G, and it's got an A chord, and it's got D. We didn't have time to really spend a whole lot of time talking about the chords, and I figured a lot of people would be able to get along as well as they could. And a couple people did okay, and a few other people stumbled a little bit on the chords. But, you know, we had a good time because this is jam session, and we're just having fun. So we went around the circle again a couple times and did a few other tunes. And this time I took a little bit more time talking about the chords. But, you know, it occurred to me that if some of the players would have had a little bit better road map, they could have done a lot better on the accompaniment. We noticed that the singers had books full of all the songs with all the words, and they'd overlook each other's shoulders when they were singing songs so they could remember how the words went. And, you know, something that kind of dawned on me is that I should, have brought, I should have brought my own book up there. I wrote a book, and this book is called A Chord Encyclopedia for 1,400 Fiddle Tunes and Country Dance Melodies. And I put this book together just for occasions like jam sessions, because I love playing at jam sessions. So this book has got the chords for over 1,400 tunes. Now it says 1,400 on it, but there's really about 1,450 tunes in there. And right toward the beginning, I mentioned Arkansas Traveler. And Arkansas Traveler is right there in the book, along with a lot of other tunes, including Irish tunes, Scottish tunes, English tunes, bluegrass tunes, French Canadian tunes, Swedish tunes, tunes that people play on the fiddle when they go to jam sessions. And concentrating on some of the standards, the ones that are the most popular. So um, here's Arkansas Traveler. And the chords are laid out in a chord chart here so that anyone that's got a guitar or a mandolin or an accordion or so forth they can read the chord chart, they can see the order of the chords I think maybe you can see that there and they can play right along just like if they had the words and they were a singer and they were reading the words and let me put my fiddle down just for a second here I'm going to read you some of the names of some of these tunes here here's one called the Kilfenora which is an Irish jig Here's, uh, let's see, here's one called Kiss Me Waltz, which is a bluegrass tune by Bill Monroe. Here's Katie Did, which is an old-timey reel. Here's uh, Caw River, which is a Texas-style fiddle tune. Here's the Keel Row, which is a common tune. Here's one called the Kelly Waltz. Here's the Kesh Jig, which is a real common Irish jig that people play. Here's a Kid on the Mountain, which is an Irish slip jig. I'm just going to open the book at random here and read a couple others. Here's the Georgiana Moon, which is a common waltz, country waltz. Here's Georgia Railroad, which is an old-time American tune. Here's Jordy McLeish, which is a Scottish reel. So what I've done is put all these tunes in order, 1,450 tunes approximately, and you can look these up. You can take them right to the jam session. And this little book, I made it this size so that fiddle players can take it and put it in their fiddle case. So when they go to a jam session, they can pull it out, hand this to the guitar players, and say, okay, now I'm going to play such and such a reel. And whoever's playing guitar for accompaniment, or piano, or maybe accordion, or maybe mandolin, they can look up the chords for particular tunes. Now, I've noticed that a few people come to me and they say, you know, Ryan, this book's great. you got over 1,400 tunes in there, but you know, the print's a little bit small for my eyes. I have to wear my reading glasses. So what I did is I printed another version with large size print. And if you think that this book might be interesting for you, 
uh, to use in some of your jam sessions that you go to, you can look this up at CaptainFiddle.com, which is my website. And I have it listed right there at CaptainFiddle.com. And you can check out the, how to order and how to get it directly through the mail, directly to you. And I'm real proud of this book. And, you know, I carry a copy myself, usually in my fiddle case. But this particular jam session, I didn't. So I just wanted to relay to you how good I think this book is and how useful it would be for you. And I guess I'm going to go out and play one more tune before we go out and leave you here. At the end of the evening up at the jam session, someone said, Hey, Ryan, we know that you and your son play Scottish tunes and play some Celtic things. He said, why don't you play one of those? So we picked this tune to play. <laughs> tune called Spudiscary, and it's from the Shetland Islands out of Scotland, and sure that the chords are right in my tune book. So um, if I had the tune book up there, I could have showed him that, but I, I won't forget next time. And again, if you're interested in my book and want to find out a little bit more about it, go to CaptainFiddle.com, look it up, and I hope that you have a lot of fun at your jam sessions. <laughs>